Like most captive killer whales, Shamu comes from a family of fish eaters. Shamu's group happens to like fish. But could they develop a taste for sea lions, dolphins, whales, or even humans? But that is to underestimate the powerful force of culture in killer whale life. Sharma's group simply has no interest in hunting mammals. Fish eating is a specialized lifestyle, passed on within a particular killer whale family from one generation to the next. Mammal hunting killer whales have their own distinct traditions. They don't interbreed with fish eaters. In killer whale society, as in our own, identity is defined by who you mix with and what you do. Whales from different backgrounds behave quite differently. There is no Jekyll and Hyde personality. It seems the gentle Shamu really is quite different from the mammal hunters of the open ocean. A marine mammal that shares a great deal in common with her human admirers. A whale with a culture.